Because once I, once, I, once I put it together on the on a, on a final mix down, I got booked. So it, it, hit, it hit the street because family had it. So, you know, family was letting people get it, and it was leaking a little bit through the studios and all that. But 21 grand is it. Right now, if I drop 21 grand, the niggas would be under siege. Mm -hmm. It's relevant. If I drop 21 grand right now, there's a lot of mixtapes I can name that's on the market that's spinning that would be under siege. Like, yeah. 21 grand was, was crazy. That shit so is relevant 10 around, years later. I dig back around and let them know, like, oh, I'm going to be back around, but I'm going to do 21 grams part two, and that's going to that's going hurt them, man. That's what I'm working on right now, man. Now, 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 now listen, now, listen. <laughs> be, be, because I get a little bit more personal, and you know that our relationship where it lay at, Hey, yo, listen, man, I know you went through a few things in your life last year and shit like that, and a lot of people don't know, my nigga, you feel me? So it's just certain right. things, like I said, if you don't want to answer and talk about it and shit. Man, I'm an open book, man, I'm an open book, yeah, man. Like, man. Like, a lot of people don't know, like, right now, like, you know, I, I'm going through, I go through a lot, you feel me? Like, I lost my mother and my brother, man, March the 16th, you know what I'm saying? Put a black cloud over me, man, that probably ain't gonna never leave, you feel me? You know what I'm saying? My little brother right. passed in the sleep, rest in peace, David yeah. Cannon, you know what I'm saying? And my mother, she was murdered, you know what I'm saying? Cynthia Cannon. By some, some whole ass nigga, you know what I'm saying? And this was... I take this, that, I take that, like, the pain, I take the pain from that and, and go hard because, listen, if anybody paid attention to me from then to now, my my, my drive was so different because it, it just took me to be like, yo, you know what, H, all you got is your brothers out here, your, 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 your street fam and you. Like, I looked at it, like, it's times I looked at it like, damn, my folks gone, right? Because my dad also gone. Fruity, Fruity Bernard Alfred, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, say that, say that. He, he, Rest he, piece, fruit. He, he also gone, so I looked at it like, damn, like, when you get laid down in these streets, man, who gonna put you in the box, bruh? So that's what made me really, like, want to go hard, you know what I'm saying? To stay away from a lot of shit. A lot of dudes, I start looking in their face, they start looking like snakes, and I don't pop pills, I don't do molly to eat, I never done none of that shit. So when I say that, don't think like a nigga was out here hallucinated, no, it was just real shit. I'm saying that's why I got a select amount of people that you would see me on his phones with or or catch me chatting with or my whips. You know what I'm saying. And, and listen, this, this what I'm saying. Like you know, like I said, the inside always know. But a lot of people don't know that this is shit that happened in a matter of two to three weeks back to back. This shit, this shit happened on 26 days. The 26 days. From, from March 5th to the 26th, man, that's what happened, man. My brother died on the 5th, my mom died the 26th, man. So it was like in a month, we ain't get to finish more than my brother. My mom didn't get to finish more than her son, you know what I'm saying? You say that, man. So it was like, it was, it was a whole thing going on. I ain't even get to more of my folks yet. I'm trying to tell you the truth, I ain't even get to drop no tears yet, because I probably won't stop, and that's a hundred. You know what I'm saying? Real shit, real shit. I, I, I try to be like, you know what I'm saying? I try to keep my composure because you know I got my niece. I got Butterball looking up to me, you know what I'm saying? My brother's daughter's only daughter, you know what I'm saying? Angelia Cannon. Like, we still hold his name up, man. Cannon family, you know what I'm saying? And, and it's a lot of shit. A lot, a lot of shit that niggas really don't know, like, as far as, like, you got a lot of unreleased music, you feel me? And me personally, as being your brother, I know that from listening to your older music, which been hot from then till since these things happen in your life, I just see the growth in you and I see you evolving every day, you feel me? And I, just you as a man and you as an artist, I see nothing but growth through the shit and I know that this has to play a major impact on that. Yeah, man, it definitely does, man. I know she looking down on me. I don't know if you listened to the first joint. I, I mean, I gave y'all. I said, rest the peace to mine. I know she looking down on me. You feel me? Yeah, we was there. Like, I we know she there. looking down on me, her and my brother. And it's like, they expect so much. Like, so right now, I, I'm, I feel way out of pocket even being in this jump. You know, they got this new bail system where you can't bail out. Because if I had a bail, I'd have been home. You so they got this new bail reform. Right, you know? Know? So you really got to sit, especially when your charges is heavy. So right now I'm sitting, but I know they looking down on me like, come on, H, like I failed them. But I know in the same token, they looking at me like, yo, you going to get back straight. I know what's going on because my mind is focused on just that. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, by the grace of God, man, hopefully everything will be all right, man. You know what I'm saying? Okay. And, I'm, and, and my angels is on my soldier, on my, on my shoulders. You know what I'm saying? Hell uh, yeah, man. I already know how that go, man. Yo, what I, what I, 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 lost, I lost my pops and I was the same way. Like, you, you, you know what I mean? Some tears come late, man. Come they late. come late because it's like you be dealing with so much. Like I know, I know. Like sometimes I be wanting to, but I'm like, first of all, I ain't even in the environment for that. I'm done. Six so it was like, Hey yo, hey yo, hey, my, hey, listen. My composure just for that. You, hey yo, listen. Sixty seconds. At the end of the day, you know, just call right back and, and get this shit right back in tune. You heard me? We gonna let this shit rock. Know that. Hey yo, how you cut this shit on, bro? I had to plug my shit up to the charger. What's up with this joint? 
Word up. Hey. I'm going to hit y'all right back, man. Live from the kitchen, man. Live from the rec hall, man. Hell yeah, kitchen, man. Hey, this is this, this is the best interview thus far, my nigga. Hey, word up. And this is this word is family, nigga. Nigga. This ain't, nigga. This ain't even business. It's personal. Look, look I'm going to let niggas this know right now. This ain't none of this shit business right. about the money, nigga. This shit is about bringing South Jersey together, man. I'm a cool nigga. You know, you know me. You know how I built, you know how I built up, my... Man. I heard you know. Come on, man. Everybody, I don't got no enemies, bro. I'm bringing this whole shit together, bro. And this is how it's coming, bro. You know I know, bro. And you a legend. Like, when you Check came, like, nigga, the stars lined this shit up, bro. You feel me? God lined this shit up, bro. Because you was in the... I just hopped in the car. Mob stopped past. You feel me? Mob stopped past every now and then. He stopped past. You called. I was like, man, fuck that. We going to get my man his time to shine. You know what I mean? We going to get him on the air. We going we gonna to do this. And like you said, listen, nigga, I don't never leave nobody for dead. Nigga, I know you coming home. You feel me? And when you touch, it's still going down. You already know. You know what I mean? No cut on it. How could you hate me? Really? Haven't I paid my dues? Then I weather the storm. Niggas is gone when I'm here. Getting flyer. How could you hate me, nigga? We talk about a deeper kind of love. This is like the way you love your child. That's a superstar, Jane, baby. Nigga, who you think you dissing? Better get some money. Get some money. Yeah, I hear the sneak dissing. You can never touch me. Never touch I was me. in Puerto Rico with this mixed thing. Mixed bang. Smoking on the strip like it's shit. Like it's shit. Came back. Some niggas think they run the city. Run the city. When you couldn't hold it down if you was under big. And why all your balls? You be killing shit. Killin and shit. when I ask around the hood, you ain't killing shit. Killin shit. If you got a job, then stay on your job. Stay on your job. You can't be mixing nine to five, playing with the mob. Know that. You know the corner boy gon' sell a ride. Right. Tight nigga, try to hit him. He'll tell us mom. <laughs> Telling folks, call that shit dropping down. Dropping down. On my oath, I ain't never dropping mine. Dropping mine. Talking like a hoe, I get you right in line. Right. I got this off the stove, it only took a nine. Just call poppin' shit. There's no cut on it. How could you hate me? Haven't I paid my dues? Then I weather the storm. Niggas is gone when I'm here. Getting flyer. How could you hate me? On the map, I'm like a head then. Cause I ain't never hated, that's on everything. Know that. Coming early, never late, and say my damn change. They change. always say it's something, niggas be in every land. But how you jump in mine, must be trying to shine. Be trying nigga, shine. I put it on shine, you ain't got the time. Bruh. And you can ask the streets, you ain't got the grind. Ain't got the grind. I just been away, but now they back in line. They back in line. On the corner, smoking on marijuana. Bruh. You was still on the porch, they was hopping up out the tourists. Know that. Trying to find packs to send a nigga right back. Right. You know that five pack will get you a five flat. Woo. My niggas in the feds, they love when I write that. Right. The bitches do the J-Pay, they love when I Skype that. Superstar game, baby. There's no cut on it. How could you hate me? Haven't I paid my dues? Then I weather the storm. Niggas is gone when I'm here. Getting flyer. How could you hate me? We talk about a deeper kind of love. This is like the way. And you know, everybody got something to live for, and everybody definitely gonna have a reason for something to die for. Hey, yo, listen, let niggas know what's the drive for your music, bro. Where, where do it come from? And honestly, the reason why I do music because it was a home invasion in 2008. You know, when Meek was first getting on, I was running with Meek, paying for his little parties and stuff and promoting for him and actually cutting a check for a situation. I come home from okay. one night, and my uncle was the same age as me at the time, got shot in his head in my house in a home invasion. I come in and find his three-month-year-old daughter laying in his bud in my house, and he was a rapper. I never wanted to be a rapper, but when he died, it motivated me to rap and live out his dreams, so that's the reason why I rap. Definitely, definitely. <laughs> And, and, and niggas gotta know that sometimes Because sometimes when niggas hit the bars And they so hard They, you know, they say, they say This nigga's super tough This nigga ain't really about that But when they learn where niggas really come from And they see it's living off experience, my nigga it, it, you, You're not living from a movie You understand what I'm saying? This is all life This is all factual shit yeah, Exactly and, and niggas need to know that sometimes Up, I appreciate y'all, man. I'll be safe. I'm gonna put H-Rack on the phone, man. Great, so 
situate my situation, man. I appreciate it. You know, I fuck a lot from the kitchen. And we'll definitely be back in the mix. And say that, Definitely. say that, man. Hey, hey, listen, listen. The lines is always open for y'all niggas, man. Always, the, the number is up there. You know what it is. Hey, listen, man. Feel free to call at any time. You hear me? You always going to bust through and let the world know what you're trying to let them know. Oh, 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 oh. Listen, listen, listen. I got to get into my radio shit because I've been quiet. I've been quiet this whole podcast. I got to get into my radio shit. You feel me? <laughs> Yo, baddest bitch in the industry, nigga. I don't care what motherfucking acting, music, nigga, whatever, nigga. What's the baddest bitch in the industry, nigga? I say Bernice Burgos, man. Woo. Okay. Okay. We gonna we gonna put we gonna put her up on the board, bro. Cause I got a board going. We gonna we got a board. She number one right now. Just just the first time I'm asking this question. You feel me? We knew. Yeah, right. I mean we knew. She number one. She number one. Okay. You know what I mean? That's how we doing it. Baddest bitch in the industry. Entertainment, period. Nigga, I don't care if she a ballerina. <laughs> Yo, niggas, niggas ain't hate geeking, nigga. We turning up now, because now, now God go in the radio mode. You feel me? So now we asking bullshit. <laughs> now we asking them bullshit questions, man. You know what I mean? But now we back at it. Yo, listen. Word up. Word up. I, I appreciate you, bro. You know what I mean, this 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 no this, problem, this gonna take the kitchen to the next level. You know what I mean? Yeah, it really Definitely. did. Yeah, you got an exclusive, you know, yeah. from a nigga that's exclusive. So you already, man. This, this yeah. right here. Nigga, you work, nigga, you working. You got songs out here with industry that's niggas, nigga. That's all we can ask for. You feel me? Right. Ain't too many niggas in our city that got a song with a nigga like that. You ain't too many. Saying? Ain't too many niggas. But like our I city said, city. yeah, like I said, it's the South Jersey Renaissance going on, so it's shit popping, bro. But you definitely out right. there. You got song with Young Dolphy in the industry. You know what I mean? I've been che- I, I, I've been, I've been checking on everybody. That's what I do. I'm the studies. I'm an old nigga, so I, I I gotta go on YouTube to find out who popping. <laughs> you know what I mean? Right. So I know he, I know he one of them. You know what I mean? So I know you doing your yep. thing. You know what I mean? So keep working. You know what I mean? Definitely, cause y'all be safe. I'm giving back H phone. You already hold your head, bro. All right, you too, cause appreciate it. You already. Yo. Hey yo, what's up, boy? Yeah, you already know, man. Hey, hey yo, so man. My, my, my boy, man, Lane, man, Prince Lane, man, he got Philly jumping around, man. We're working on a little bit of things up in this joint, man. Hey, hey, hey yo, you listening, man? <laughs> Yeah, I'm listening, bro. Hey, hey, yo, I'm in here talking. You know, we all in here. We all got hella years in. And, you know, niggas talking about finessing and this and this and that. And niggas going to say right now that you had a lot of inspiration from somewhere, you know what I mean? And it's a nigga that me and you both know, you heard me? A smooth old head nigga, and he behind that wall right now. And a nigga want to ask about him, you heard me? Right, right. Yeah, you know. Nigga, yeah, I want to ask about it, nigga. He, Shorty Mac. You ain't got to say the name. He knew who you talking Shorty about. Shorty Mac, you already know, man. My, my boy be home next year, man. He been, he been down going on 16 years, Ooh. man. That's a big part of my inspiration. You know, he raised me. You feel me? You know, he showed me the game. You know, at the ends and outs, he showed me all that. You feel me? He on his way, man. He definitely on his way. Like, long, as long as I know H, that nigga always reference Shorty Mac. Like, yo, Shorty Mac, nigga. That's what he always said. That. You feel me? I know you that, man. Listen, that's, 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 that be the problem with the young boys. They ain't got no goddess. My goddess was a hundred. Like, if anybody know my god, the boy, the boy that showed me, I mean, he was a hundred. And a lot of these young boys, they, they lack that, man. They had they had goddess like that, man. Won't be none of this going on out here, man. Nothing. Word up. That's, that's the boy, man. Free Eric Miles, man. Shoot me back, man. To the end, man. You know what's going on. Hey, hey, yo, man, listen, I, uh, you know, bro, we go back so far, and it's like, you know, re- regardless of what the situations may have ever been, or whatever, you know what I mean, just your whole persona, you've always been, and I'm put, quote, unquote, a larger than life nigga, like, you know, your name always supersedes a lot of shit, you feel me, and I know that, you know what I mean, during the years of growth that just passed, you actually, you really, 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 you didn't motherfucking broke the knob on these niggas, you feel me? You broke the knob on these niggas. Real, 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 nah, real turn shit, up, my man. nigga. Turn up to the max on these niggas, bro. Blue, blue, blue the JLs, you feel me? So, at the end of the day, you know what I mean? And you know, for some shit like this to happen at a time like this, you know, as of right now, I just need you to let niggas know because, you know, 
you know, a lot of niggas out here suck dick, a lot of hating ass niggas, and niggas don't know that it's still, it's, it's still some hope there, you feel me? Still real niggas Yo, out, listen, man. man, let the people in the world know that this shit ain't lit on this shit. I don't want, you know, my lord be telling me Nah, 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 don't say too much, don't give them too much. Listen, nigga, this the kitchen, nigga, don't get nobody in Listen, listen, don't give them too much, you heard me? Don't give him too. Don't give him too much, bro. Like, like, like my lord, my lord be like, yo, keep everything on the wrap. But he like this, man. Listen, at the end of the day, where you was at, you ain't even a place of residence. You ain't doing nothing. So like, it's like basically like I'm just sitting, man. I'm sitting for nothing. Like they went somewhere that wasn't even I wasn't even tied to. So I don't even. I really don't even know what's going on. I'm just sitting on the joint. Like I don't know what's up, man. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. I'm just sitting and this shit ain't about nothing. I'm, that's why I smile every day. That's why I get on this radio station and go in and do all that because exactly. this shit ain't about nothing to me, man. Exactly, cause I'm keeping real shit, bro. You know a lot of niggas. Uh, Yo, listen, they, 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 listen, when you, listen, listen. When you been to the bottom, nigga, you ain't got no problem going back to the bottom, nigga. So that's what niggas, bro, right. bro niggas hey, know. Hey, hey, that's what I was just trying to tell my people. I'm like, yo, regardless of what, even if they try to fix me, man, I'm cool on the ride. Just get my eyes, my eyes, my, my, my tablet but, ready, my TV ready, man. But, but you, you, you already know, though, bro. At the end of the day, like I say, man, a lot of niggas. A lot of niggas don't want to pay homage to this and that And when niggas do certain shit You know, you got a lot of haters around and shit But listen, bro, I'm one of the niggas that been around I see you coming through in that seven with the tents on the joint I see <laughs> yeah. you coming through whipping that yeah. slingshot kick, yeah. kick, Kicking the shit out of that back tire You feel me, bro? Yeah, Nig- do niggas don't like yo, niggas don't like to I see you come through. Point. Niggas don't like to see you come through with the nigga. Versace shades on and the pinky joint. I see the nigga live in Puerto Rico. And I'm like, you feel me? Yeah. Hey, listen, yeah, listen, bro, listen. I love that shit, bro. When that's I inspiration. Like that, I do it for the have nots, man. Nah, you do it for inspiration, bro. That's where I come from. Real shit. I'm keeping it real. So when I jump out of the 750 or I jump out the slingshot, the motorcycle, or me and my girl hop off the twin scooters or something like that, I do that for the have nots. But for the niggas who ain't had shit, got shit now. Say you put, that, I put that, from, I you put that from, to put the inspiration niggas back. Two, two niggas on the phone with me right now. I came from us eating out the same, same platters, jumping out, jumping out the same bed off the same floor, or whatever. I'm saying, going the same bathroom in the morning. Like it's like, like, like niggas really grew up like, like, like off that. So like, I came up like. You know, we've changed the channel with the pliers and all. I came from that era. I really say say from that, from say that. that. Allu- <laughs> aluminum for you all on the antenna and that. Look, no, got, got you. No, listen, listen. Got your young boy. Got your young boy. Got, got your young boy over there talking about yo. Got your young boy over there talking about yo. Hold your right hand to the left and hold your right foot to the right and don't move. Cause we trying, we we be trying to watch wrestling right now. Cause I need to see this show, bro. Hey, hey, hey. Well, shit. You feel me? Hey, hey, hey yo, like, man. Yo. I'm from that era, man. I definitely come from that. I come from where it was like that oodles and noodles and hot dogs and burgers. <laughs> Niggas, yo, listen, and it's the crazy shit, listen, a lot of motherfuckers, hey, listen, yo, a couple weeks ago, I ate a couple oodles and noodles, right, and a nigga gonna tell me, he said, hey, yo, man, for real, bro, you must love jail, eating the oodles and noodles, I said, motherfucker, before I ever knew what jail was, this was a regular part, this, 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 this was, this was, this, this was, this was lean cuisine right here, niggas was, niggas was slamming noodles on the floor before the county, my nigga, niggas got it fucked up, <laughs> Right, right, you feel me? Hey, yo. Nah, a lot of people don't come from that era, man. Like, well, the, like, like, that's why I'm still in tune with the folks I'm in tune with, man, because we all come from that era. And that, when you, that era right there, that's where all the good dudes is at. It's like our generation, like, that's where most of the good dudes is at. Someone's sour, you, I can't front on it, but that's where most of the good dudes are at, and they had God, and they had good people in their life, you know what I'm saying? Like, look, look where, look where we can be at, look where Jinx can be at, look where you can be at, Mom, look where I'm at, you know what I'm saying? So it's like, you know what I'm saying? You know the, you know the shit that we come from and, and the shit that we had to weave and to, to, to get to where we at. Man, I was, yo, I no, no, no bullshit, no rainbow, no rainbow. Yeah. I was out there on a the low, proud as hell of Jinx, because he made it. He one of the niggas who made it, you know what I'm saying? Exactly. With everything he doing with the, with the Alibaba Jones getting everything, busting moves with that, with the podcast, with the beats. He got everything he got going on, and, and, and he... He taking off, and that's yo. I was proud of that, and and, and and sixty. It was just, it was just like a good feeling because it was like, it was like the one nigga from, from the hood who made it. He the one nigga that got out, really. You feel me? Yeah, say I'm that. real proud of you, bro. And bro, nigga, shit. And nigga, listen, I'm gonna let you know <laughs> to clarify for the audience. I ain't make it out financially, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> I made, I made it out mentally. I made that mentally because nigga, there's a lot of mental blocks too, bro. Your mind made it because your mind, your mind worth, your your mind worth a billion dollars. I'm saying, so that's all that counts. The money ain't, the money won't come back. Nigga but just need to. Nigga need the right contacts. That's all a nigga need. The right contacts. Come up with a hundred dollar scheme. 
I need my family, nigga. I need HB. I need Ma. I need Camden. That's who I need, bro. That's who we need, That's bro. It's all about us. We ain't gonna make. Ain't nobody gonna make it by themselves. Hey yo, you gotta call back. You gotta call back. Call back. Call back. He gonna know. He gonna know.